Ezra Venechemnia Ezra 8 These are now the chief of their fathers, and this is the genealogy of them that went up with me from Babel in the reign of Artach Shashta, the king, of the sons of Penikach, Gershom, of the sons of Ithamar, Daniel, of the sons of David, Chatush, of the sons of Shechanyahu, of the sons of Farosh, Zachariahu, and with him were reckoned by genealogy of the males a hundred and fifty, of the sons of Pachath, Moab, Elhionai, the son of Zachariah, rather Zerachiah, and with him two hundred males, of the sons of Shechanyahu, the son of Yachaziel, and with him three hundred males, of the sons also of Adin, Eved, the son of Yoh, Nathan, and with him fifty males, and of the sons of Elam, Yashayahu, the son of Athaliahu, and with him seventy males, and of the sons of Shephat Yahu, Zevadyahu, the son of Mikael, and with him fourscore males, of the sons of Yoav, Ovadyahu, the son of Yahi El, and with him two hundred and eighteen males, and of the sons of Shalomith, the son of Yosifayah, and with him a hundred and threescore males, and of the sons of Bevai, Zechariahu, the son of Bevai, and with him twenty and eight males, and of the sons of Asgad, Yahuchanan, the son of Chotan, and with him a hundred and ten males, and of the last sons of Adoni Cham, whose names are these, Eliphelet, Yeiel, and Shemayahu, and with them threescore males. Of the sons also of Bigvai, Uthai, and Zabud, Zekir, and with them seventy males. And I gathered them together to the river that runs to Ahava, and there abode we in tents three days. And I viewed the people and the priests, and found there none of the sons of Levi. Then sent I for Eliezer, for Ariel, for Shemayahu, and for Elnathan, and for Yariv, and for Elnathan, and for Nathan, and for Zachariahu, and for Meshulam, chief men. Also for Yoyariv, and for Elnathan, men of understanding. And I sent them with commandment unto Ido, the chief, at the place Kachifeya. And I told them what they should say unto Ido, and to his brethren the Nathin, at the place Kachifia, rather Kachsifia, that they should bring unto us ministers for the house of our Elohim. And by the good hand of our Elohim upon us, they brought us a man of understanding, of the sons of Mechli, the son of Levi, the son of Yashadael, and Sheravyah with his sons and his brethren, eighteen. And at Chashkavyahu, and with him Yashayahu, of the sons of Marii, rather, Marari, his brethren and their sons, twenty. Also of the Nathin, whom David and the princes had appointed for the service of the Leviim, two hundred and twenty Nathin, all of them were expressed by name. Then I proclaimed a fast there at the river of Ahava, that we might afflict ourselves before our Elohim 
to seek of him a right way for us and for our little ones and for all our substance. For I was ashamed to require of the king a band of soldiers and horsemen to help us against the enemy in the way. Because we had spoken unto the king, saying, The hand of our Elohim is upon all them for good that seek him, but his power and his wrath is against all them that forsake him. So we fasted and besought our Elohim for this, and he was entreated of us, then I separated twelve of the chief of the priests, Sheravyah, Chashavyahu, and ten of their brethren with them, and weighed unto them at the silver, and at the gold, and at the vessels, even the offering of the house of our Elohim, which the king and his counselors and his governors and all Yashadael there present had offered. I even weighed unto their hand six hundred and fifty talents of silver, and silver vessels a hundred talents, and of gold a hundred talents, also twenty basins of gold, of a thousand drams, and two vessels of fine copper, precious as gold. And I said unto them, Ye are holy unto Yahweh, the vessels are holy also, and the silver and the gold are a free will offering unto Yahweh Elohai, rather, Yahweh Elohim of your fathers. Watch ye and guard them until ye weigh them before the chief of the priests and the Leviim, and chief of the fathers of Yashadael at Yarushalayim in the chambers of the house of Yahweh. So took the priests and the Leviim the weight of the silver and the gold and the vessels to bring them to Yerushalayim unto the house of our Elohim. Then we departed from the river of Ahava on the twelfth day of the first month to go unto Yerushalayim. And the hand of our Elohim was upon us, and he delivered us from the hand of the enemy and of such as lay in wait by the way. And we came to Yerushalayim and abode there three days. Now on the fourth day was the silver and the gold and the vessels weighed in the house of our Elohim by the hand of Merayoth, the son of Uriahu, the priest, and with him was Eleazar, rather Elazar, the son of Pinachach, and with them was Yozavad, the son of Yahshua, and Noadiah, the son of Binui, Levein, rather, Levi'im, by number and by weight of everyone, and all the weight was written at that time. Also the children of the house that had been carried away, which were come out of the captivity, offered burnt offerings unto the Elohim of Yashar'el, twelve bullocks for all Yashar'el, ninety and six rams, seventy and seven lambs, twelve he-goats for a sin offering. All this was a burnt offering unto Yahweh. And they delivered at the king's commissions unto the king's lieutenants and to the governors on this side the river. And they furthered at the people and at the house of Elohim.